Okay, well functionally what we do is we are a consumer product company. We own products or li exclusively license them on an evergreen basis, which is just like owning them. Uh, and we create them, you know, so we actually take a product, we name it. You know, we, uh, you know, we see in, the way it works is we said, geez, the acne business, you know, tooth whitening, you know, white teeth, brown teeth, clear skin, not clear skin, we should be in that business. And, and so we decided we want to be in the acne business. We didn't have a product. We didn't have a developer, but we knew we wanted to get in that business. So I went out and looked for and started interviewing dermatologists. Um, and so our business is finding products that we think meet a market need, owning them, licensing them, tying them up to a developer, a story, because we have found through our research that people would much rather buy a product from a person than an ivory tower. Uh, you know, if, if we said, you know, Bechtel has done the greatest research of all time and this product will whiten your teeth, the channel would be flipped so fast your head would spin. Uh, you know, so we had to learn, you know, we had to marry meeting a market need with a, you know, with a marketing technique. And so our business is finding the need, creating the product, naming the product, positioning the product, manufacturing the product, creating marketing to create demand for the product through the use of TV infomercials and spots and, and now on the web. And because we want to control the process and I can't stand retail, uh, we control the process throughout. So we, will, we own 35,000 toll-free phone numbers, don't need them as much as we used to because people respond so much on the web. We own tons of URLs. Uh, we'll advertise. People will respond either through an inbound telephone you know, call. We cause that call, that call to be answered. We give people opportunities to buy related products on that phone call. Um, uh, and then we typically give them a chance to keep ordering that product for the rest of their life until they tell us to stop. Uh, and then we also uh, offer the products up on the web. And then we have to provide customer service. Um, you know, this month we'll take, you know, our phone bill each year is about $150 million. You know, this month we'll take you know, I don't know, 600,000 phone calls uh, around the world. Um, and so we'll take those phone calls, we'll answer them, we'll, we have a merchant account to collect the money, we will ship the product to the customer, if they don't like it, we'll take the return, and we'll just take it from soup to nuts. So we're kind of control freaks. Uh, you know, so we, we, we own the product, we also own our distribution pipe. And in 1995, that was bizarre and unusual. Now, with the web, and you know, there's lots of businesses that do that now.